How do you beep when someone swears? You also need to cover the mouth because it's quite obvious what they said. So if I say, I love my subscribers. <laughs> How do you make this effect? How do you create this? It's very, very simple and I'm going to show you in this video. So if you like this video, subscribe and check out the thanks button under this video. Comment for any questions as well. Okay, so how do you want to beep someone when they swear? Or is it you, basically? I love my f Okay, I'm not gonna play this because I don't want to, you know, I want to monetize this video, by the way. So I'm not gonna play that word, but it's right here, okay? This is where it's happening. Subscribers. Okay, so basically in this area, okay? So this is where it happens. Let me just also like make a cut here or you can put the marker. And basically until here, okay? Or I can just expand this marker right here. Boom. And then if you hold option key, you can expand this marker um, and have it as one. Okay. So the first thing is the sound. And the second thing is the mouth because people can still read if you say a swear word, okay, so we need to cover the mouth as well. Let's start with the audio because this is a little bit simpler. You already have a beep in your Premiere Pro, even if you don't know about it, okay? Okay, so go to your project files or you can go to file new, bars and tone, or you can go to your project files and then click on new item icon at the bottom and you will find bars and tone. And this is very old school. It's used for color, setting up the color of your footage for the broadcast and so on. So basically you have the bars, the color bars and tone as well. We don't really use it anymore. It depends on the broadcaster um, and so on, but it's still here available because it's quite handy. Okay, so bars and tone, and you can go to HD Rec 709, the color doesn't really matter right now. It's literally just a beep and that's all. You will see you have these colors, um, bars and tone. So we're just going to use the tone basically. So I can deselect my source for video and then just drag this as an audio. Okay. Cause you don't need the video really. Um, so this is how it sounds. Let me just take down my voice for this section, which is saying very nasty word, haha, <laughs> which I like to say quite often. I love my f***ing subscriber. Okay, and we need to shift this a bit more. So I love my... I love my... So basically it's this f***ing subscriber. Okay. And let's make this shorter a little bit. I love my subscribers to me it sounds pretty good to be honest so let's work on the visual let's do like a you can do like a blur or whatever but i'm gonna do old school rectangle no stroke fill let's make it black uh like this this okay let me go a bit closer and let's write something funny on it like those let me just align the layers brilliant <laughs> okay so this is where i would go based on that beep right there this is where i say it my subscriber yep let me just do fit my subscriber yeah, let's animate this just for fun. Because you need to cover the mouth and if it's moving, you need to make sure it moves with it. Position. Mm. Eh. Eh. Okay. A bit higher. Uh, let's put some interpolation on it. Easy and ease out. <laughs> Subscriber. Yep. I love my subscribers. <laughs> yep, that's literally it. I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you have any questions, comment below. Check out my social media right here. Subscribe to this channel for more. And check out the thanks button under the video as well. So I hope to see you next time.